Welcome, 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 my boy. What's going on, man? Oh, we, we're getting the feedback right now. Let, let us get our feedback right now. Because we want the people to hear the sky boss real good. You know, see it. All right. What's up, what's up, what's yeah. up, Sky Boss? How you doing, brother? Sky Boss, today I know I'm going to take it easy on the Friday evening, I know. I'm a sound. Yeah, you sound good, man. Papa, man. When I sound good. Sky Boss, today the general day. <laughs> yeah man, yeah man, yeah man. Welcome to the Friday Night Vibes and UVC Radio, the song that binds us together with me. Your man King Rocco up in the building. And my man DJ G Fire. All the way North Carolina, you know what I mean? Yeah man, G Fire. What, 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 what do we got there, man? Are you gonna the, re, Yo. re, give a little introduction of the Sky Boss? Yeah man, definitely. Have to give an introduction to the Sky Boss. You know, who better to give that introduction than of course Sky Boss himself? Yo, Sky Boss. To the people, who is Sky Boss? Sky Boss is an independent recording artist, producer, where I have my own record label, you know? I write my own songs. I even shoot my own music videos and stuff like that, you know? Excellent, excellent. So, you know, tell us a little bit about your upbringing and what really inspired you to get into music. You know, these are yeah, this is definitely one of my signature intro questions. You know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> you know what this is about, this man. Mad, what, mad, what mad. really brought you into music? Well, um, from a young age, you know, I'm like younger than ten. I find myself singing. You know, mm-hmm. singing coming from school, and you know, the big people in my always I say. Look at you. Oh, you can't sing so and you can't ever talk. You see my book, I'm a stutter, you know? Right, right. So, I find myself always I sing at school, the school concert, you know, I sing in a mm. church and things. So, when you hear that you can't sing, you always want to do it more and do it more, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Real thing, real thing. Real thing, real thing. G5, are we Facebook Live? Yeah, no, sir, but we definitely can be. We're about to be right about now. Yeah, but we're just about. Yeah, to what a what a what a name, man! Martin Luther Stevenson. Yo, oh boy, yo, wow. that, that, that name is powerful. Let, let, let's get into the Facebook, and so we, we, we want everything in other in other thing. You know, we're gonna get out, man. Yeah, you gonna tell us about that shortly, man. So definitely, good people. In the meantime, why G Five organize this stuff? Yeah, you are listening to the Friday Night Vibes right here on UVC Radio. The sound of binders together with me, your man King Rocco, and we got DJ G Five all the way from North Carolina, and we get all the way out to the Bronx, New York. We got my man Sky Boss in the building. So definitely, you guys um, can definitely join us in Zoom on five four three nine seven two one six five two and. And all of our Facebook family, bigger, 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 big up yourself, wherever in the globe you guys are locked on right now. We definitely appreciate the time that you guys take to listen to us right now. We want to say special good morning, special good evening to everybody. All right. So, you know, G Fire, everything set, everything turned up. All right. So, Sky Boss. All right. So, we live yes, right now on Facebook. So, all right. Tell us, man. I mean, yeah, we have to pull it back, pull originally? it back. Martin Luther Stevenson. Yo, yo, yes, yo, sir, that's a sir. powerful name, brother. You you want to tell For us, real. I mean, you know, a name like a that, name. I have a lot of great inspiration behind it, you know what I'm saying? And I'm sure you must be inspired from a powerful name like that, man. Where are you from, Sky Boss? Well, um, I was born in Kingston, right? My mother was living at 25 Fifth Street, that's in Rima. That's Rima. You have Rima, Johnstone, Jung, yeah. Tivoli. So the, 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 the real, the real tough part of Jamaica. The real tough, tough, jungle, tough. You know? Mm-hmm. The real co- concrete jungle. You see me? The ongle jungle. Right. Jungle, jungle. Concrete jungle. Right. Yeah, right. Man. The trench stone where you hear Bob Marley, no matter about the Rima, and, you know? You know, the mm-hmm. iron right. gardens. The whole works. The real garrison. So your so so your name you had actually seen it on a billboard somewhere. Tell us about that in in Halfway Tree. All right, you're talking about the name Balino. The name Balino was a name that I took on to myself early 2000. Right. Yeah, but um, 2015, 2016. Um, well, I started to travel to the United States like from 2014. Yeah. 
I was traveling back and forth. Right. Then, you know, I said, wait, I'm, I'm in the sky regular, regularly, you know? So I said, sky, sky, sky boss, sky general, you know? Sky, sky. Yeah. You saw yeah, man. Man. on the high level. Yeah, so, you know, I'm always in the sky. I mean, mm. I said, you know, so me is a general. Real thing. You know, so me is a boss, me is a CEO. Real thing. So why not sky, me in the sky, I'm me is a I mean, I'm my own boss. I'm self employed. You know, I'm an entrap- entrepreneur. That's Sky boss. Mm. Sky boss there. The general there. You understand? Mm. Right. So people right. refer to me as general. I mean, I'm in the sky. I'm my own boss. Mm-hmm. Sky boss there. The general is here. I'm there. Right. 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 That's what's Right. So, 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 go on. I'm, oh. I'm seeing something interesting that, that kind of caught my attention as far as you being a dancehall artist. Um, you know, one of the things that that drives you is being successful. You know, everybody has a different definition, right, of what success looks like. You know, some people, some people say, you know, they're successful. You know, when a when a gal say, you know, come breed me. Some say they're successful. <laughs> some say some say they're successful when they strap with the forty five special. You know, but yeah, what I what is what what is success to you? Uh, what is success? To me is is when you work to build something to a level that's right you know and where where you see a lot of people would love to reach mm-hmm. and a lot of people would love to achieve what you achieve at your work and build Ritting, it and yeah. maintain it mm-hmm. right mm-hmm. no 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 I have my own recording studio right my mm-hmm. own record label mm-hmm I know I'm building my photography department, my video graphic department. Mm-hmm. I uh, wanna um I just released another music video that you know I guess you're gonna talk talk about right. my equipment. I'm the director for that new music video also. That's what's up, man. So yeah, uh, man, for sure. Mm-hmm. So so one of the things I would like you to bring us back, man. I mean. Let us know who was Sky Boss. I mean, when Sky Boss was a kid, I mean, going to school in Jamaica. I mean, tell us a little something about Sky Boss. What kind of person Sky Boss were at that time? All right, Sky Boss was always our Martin. Martin, our Martin before Sky really Boss, fun. was a talented kid, right? I can play football and I could play cricket, mm-hmm. right? But mm-hmm. there was an incident where the cricket ball, I was home, you know, the evening. Right. Ball game after school was playing cricket. I could bat very well, but mm-hmm. a bigger guy was bowling at me, and and I was really getting some runs off him, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Then he said he's gonna bowl me a gungoli. A gungoli. I guess a <laughs> oh gungoli was yeah. a spin. Oh, it, a the spin, ball yeah, man, spins, the that. ball drop, and then it spin, and it hit me in in my shank. It hit it hit me so hard that 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 my shank swooped. Swell, and from oh, that time golly. I get so scared. That shit is painful, man. Yeah. Mm-mm. Then after that, you know what I said? Soccer, which we call football, football. Jamaica, is gonna be right. my thing. So, so by the by the time I reached grade five, mm-hmm. I started to play um for my college school, which was Asburn Store College, because I leave Kingston and went to Clarendon. Did I tell my family and my siblings that I want to stay? Mm-hmm. In the countryside, I, you know, I love the countryside. So mm-hmm. I started to keep for the under 12 team. Mm-hmm. And, and I was good at it. Mm-hmm. You know, my bigger bro- brother used to play soccer too for the community team. Mm-hmm. And then one evening I went in the goal and then the coach, the coach and teacher saw me. And I said, mm-hmm. Martin, you look good in the goal, you know, so we're going to use you as a goalkeeper. Come on training every evening. Mm-hmm. So that's how you know I become a goalkeeper for the under twelve and the number one goalkeeper, you know. Wow. Wow. Right. Wow. Yes. Yeah, Interesting. So I'm, I'm very at- athletic. Yeah. So you know you don't only have a musical part of you, but also you're v- you're very athletic. So okay. So athletic, I mean we yeah. all understand that you say you. I mean from a kid you've been actually singing and stuff like that. But from when people start recognizing you. Um, um, I mean, your music and stuff like that in Jamaica. 
Like professionally? Yes. All right. I started recording professionally, but about 2002, um, I win a Wayne Marshall um, sound alike and a look alike, and I was supposed to be awarded a recording contract. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. um, I won that contract by the time I walk on the stage, by the time Wayne Marshall called me up on the stage. The whole place was in a frenzy because I was actually looking like him at the time with the right. bandana. Also like him I used to grow my hair. <laughs> and I right. cho cho Whoa! Hey. You know that's oh. something that you fire. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> cho 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 Whoa! Hey! Mm. So it came in the star, the Jamaica star, it came in the Jamaica Gleaner, and it was broadcasting on ITV and RETV. It was broadcasting in certain parts of the world. So that competition mm -hmm. gave me a big popularity. Mm -hmm. Then I right. was fighting for Stone Love Movement. So mm -hmm. that's that's Father Paul, the owner of Stone Love yeah, Movement. Mm -hmm. And I was recording for a few local producers and a few overseas. You feel me? Right. Right. So, so from, from about 2002. Okay. So if you permit me to say, I mean, um, I know you and I talk this one and one, and if you permit me to say, what went on with you and the Alliance? Uh, mm. I, didn't, I didn't get to be a part of the Alliance, you know. But, however, when I win the way Marshall, thingy, it's like, it's a blessing and it's like a curse. Because oh, I wow. got the popularity, but I didn't have any material behind that popularity. And when I go to certain studios, they say, yo, you know, so I can't advise it because we are Marshall, a friend, and we don't want to offend Marshall. Mm. You understand? But I'm saying, Marshall supposed to do a song with me because he was the artist of the month, right? Mm -hmm. And that's supposed to be a part of the contract, <laughs> which I didn't get the contract, right? And I'm calling Wayne Marshall, I call Wayne Marshall and Wayne Marshall. Every time he give me a different date, like I call him Monday, he say, "All right, link me Thursday," you know, mm -hmm. and it never happened. So, so you know that kind of depressed me away, you see me? So is it, you so know, so stuff stuff like those depress you. So is it a situation because I mean, you have been you're, you're singing a lot like Wayne Marshall, looking like Marshall. I mean, is it a possibility? Maybe that kind of get to Wayne Marshall. People like, "Yo, Marshall, the little youth come style you up." Watch him. <laughs> Is it a situation like that? I feel like I don't fight there. Mm. You understand? Oh. You know, I feel like, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like I don't fight there. Because remember them time the wind marshal just above stuff, 2002, 2004, go down the line. Because wind marshal actually come under the wings of Bunty Killer, under the alliance. Bunty Killer. Yeah. Right, right. So, you know. Take it away. Any question? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, you know, it kind of sums it up to, um, you'll see this a lot, not just in music, but in general. Um, mm -hmm. People are always under the impression that, you know, you, you can do good, just not better than them, right? Mm -hmm. um, and, and, you know, I think that's, that's really the conclusion uh, that I draw from that experience. So, mm -hmm. moving from that experience, um, even though, um, you know, you, it was, it was a, kind of a depressing experience for you. Um, how did you kind of move on from that? It looked like him take one call or him drop out. All right, all right, all right, good people. This is the Friday Night Vibes UVC Radio, the sound of bind us together <clears throat> with me and man King Rocco in the building. And we got my man DJ G5 all the way from Durham, North Carolina, in the house, and also right out to the Browns, New York. We got Sky Boss in the building. So, all right. Until I'm back. Right, I'm, back. back. I'm back. I'm back. He's back. He's back. He's back. All right, if cool. I the question. I don't, yeah. So, I don't so, so moving on, you know, from that experience, we know that was kind of a, kind of like a depressing experience That's for you. Yeah. So, so what? How did you move on from that? And what was the next move for Sky Boss? All right. Oh, I move on from that. You know. Um. You know, sir. It's like, but it always self-employed. So. I always hustle 
I always buy things and sell. You understand? Because I live on my own from a tender age. So, you know, I have to make sure I have an income so I can pay my own bills. You understand? So, me out there, I have to make sure I work so I get paid by the end of the day so I can pay my rent. You understand? And I try to juggle the music at the same time. You understand? So, I can give the music 100%. And music is a thing with jealous like woman. If you now give it your full attention, mm -hmm. you and I are gonna fall out. You understand? Oh yeah, for sure. You and I are gonna fall out. So, you know, me been been round me look at bridging them with Bill Rhythm and where I try a thing and you know, on and off in the music, on and off. Until my migrate 2016, come to the United States, and then this year of me, I decided that guess what? I'm going to I'm going to produce myself. I have the years of experience, right? So I'm gonna produce and get myself out there under my own record label. You know, had had recording pro producer to to what I already have and name change. So it's like it's a brand new brand. The name Skybass is a brand new brand. You see me? Right. I released and I released two songs under this brand right now. Skybars Records and Skybars Music. Skybars. Precisely. Precisely. All right. But you know what, right now, G Fire? I think we should definitely pull up the Skybars track. What do you think right now, man? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Let's get into let's get into the track right now. Good people, if you would like to definitely say something to the artists, you guys can definitely leave a comment in the comment box on Facebook or on the IG page. Or likewise, you guys can definitely join us on Zoom. Please, please, whenever you come in, please keep the background noise out. Yeah, big up the artists. Let the artists feel the love. You know what I'm saying? You can join us on Zoom on five four three nine seven two one six five. Two, so we got my man Sky Boss all the way from out of the Bronx, New York. So right now, G Fire, take it away, man. Run the truck yeah. right now. Hey, 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 Turn it up. Pull it up. Friday Night Vibes, UBC Radio. Sky Boss, they are the general day. Hey! Hey! Big up all the shorties, them out there, yeah? Summer with this Spanish girl, them winter and Navidad from a city hey, girl, them hey, 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 Couple girl want solid and a dirt, dirt. Missy girl pon the mid top, and from me the boat me a flirt, flirt. I tell you, in a VIP tickers, what's a girl in a VIP tickers? Tyreek, their boats, everybody, their boats, their boats, their boats with the skimmers. What's a girl in a VIP tickers? What's a girl in a VIP tickers? Tyreek, their boats, everybody, their boats, 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 she been over me, I fi put it in there. So she love me, I sing say, make money real like a stamp on it on all night long. Dirt boats, dirt boats with the swimmers. What a girl get in a VIP tickers? What a girl get in a VIP tickers? Tyreek dirt boats, everybody dirt boats, dirt boats, dirt boats with the swimmers. What a girl get in a VIP tickers? What a girl get in a VIP tickers? Tyreek dirt boats, everybody dirt boats. Tickers are the swimmers. Jamaica, Trinidad, from America to England, anywhere. What? <laughs> yeah, man. I tell you, the most boss. 
Good people, listen, listen. Look you know, up, Mickey Mouse yes, thing, yes, man. You know, no Mickey Mouse <laughs> thing, you know. <laughs> and the real thing, you know. Boss, they the general, <laughs> they are. <laughs> <laughs> Wait on that. Yo, yo, uh, you don't know, see it. You don't know, see it. Yo, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Track, man. What, 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 what was the inspiration behind this track, man? Oh, no. oh, it's, it's fun, you know. Right. As I say, as I say, I'm going to do back music to a different level this year by producing myself, mm -hmm. right? So, I said, all right. Right. I know the majority of the producers and the artists, them. so I said, all right, we need to be musicians. So, I'm like, Sean is up. Mm -hmm. You understand? I'm going to have the next virgin name, Deja from Grab Them Records. Sean is up. When I link Sean is up, and then build a rhythm, yeah. he must say, all right. He said, all right, you are going. Dirt bounce around the place now. And by the time I finish building the rhythm, and go play it in my car. You look up at them in the community, run out and just start dirt bounce. So if you can write something about dirt bounce, mm. see me. And that's how <clears throat> dirt bounce song come, come about. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So apart from music, yeah. what Skybars do for a living? We know you're self employed. But if you wish to say, what else Skybars do for a living apart from the own music business? All right, from, from, for, for right now, I'm just going to say, um, I do rent a car. I got cars, right? And I rent my studio out, you know. Mm -hmm. And I'm going into, I'm going go, going into photography, graphic and videography. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, all right. So you do, so you do uh, rent a car. Do you, you thought about maybe ex expanding out to actually be a like a certified travel agent? Um. I'm thinking about expanding my rental car fleet, but it's a kind of risky business. You feel me? And then, and then especially, 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 especially during the pandemic. Yeah. So I don't want to rush and really expand it. I want to, I want to concrete myself. I want to establish myself as a recording artist first. So that's where my main focus is right now. You understand? But otherwise, you know, my other business those are the ones that generating most of the funds right 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 now as i say you know yeah. I, I do a name change and revamping my brand as a recording mm -hmm. artist slash producer cool cool that's what's up that's what's up oh so yeah so i mean for you as a dancehall artist we know i mean the united states is all about hip-hop r&b etc etc i mean how dancehall music really, how, how do you see a future as a dancehall artist in America? All right, remember, um, in America, da dancehall and reggae have a big market over here also. Remember that yeah, um, cranium is from, cranium is from New, New York, right? Cr cranium get the break in New York. Mm -hmm. Right. And then, not, and then, not to mention the people who, who have marketed it. Yeah, over the years, like um, you know, Drake, he kind of he kind of play around with it a little bit. I wouldn't consider what he does specifically dancehall, but he he kind of you know put it out there. You bring, you bring a diversity to it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. You, you know, it's it's a it's a marketing thing. Um, marketing. I don't. You know, I, I I feel like I can go out on a limb here and say, um, I don't think uh, you know, for Drake, it was really about the upliftment of dancehall. Per, per se um but i think you know it was Market, it was Market something business. yeah it was yeah and it was it was something to be trendy it was experimental mm -hmm. um but you know it, it when you look at dancehall music and reggae music um it really does permeate just about every genre of music mm -hmm. um in america you know from yeah, pop yeah. music to hip-hop music and pretty much everything in between so definitely a market for it but I think, um, yeah, there, there's a big market. But, but I guess my question is, um, you know, we kind of see kind of what's happening with dance hall in general. Um, mm -hmm. what are some, you know, because in the 90s, um, dance hall was really in the early 2000s, it was really its own thing, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Great difference, but now, um, sometimes it seemed like dance hall trying too hard to be like everybody else. What are some ways that you say you distinguish yourself from typical dancehall music? Good question. Yeah, indeed. All right. 
I love the nineties dance song. Right? Mm -hmm. And if you can hear in my um, oh, yeah, um, for sure. track that I just released, mm -hmm. it's on nineties, right? Absolutely. That's right. Boof, that's boof, right, that's boof. right. Mm -hmm. Right? So mm -hmm. that's that's dance all. And for, for telling the truth, I did a performance with this same song. Um in the Bronx, right here, South Bronx and Lincoln Avenue, right? Mm -hmm. And the reception that I got from that performance, it, it, it was the biggest thing. And remember, I'm in a hip hop environment, right? Mm -hmm. yes, and my Bronx. response, mm -hmm. my performance was one of the biggest I took the night, right? Mm -hmm. And I post that clipping on my Instagram page, and it's like 200 and something thousand right now as we speak viewers so if you go on my instagram yeah view viewers 200 200 200 k plus wow i just posted a couple of weeks back right so so yeah that beat man yeah absolutely the it, it, it go hard it's really catchy but... man it's, 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 it's really catchy you know what i'm saying so definitely definitely, definitely. But, but i'm i'm not knocking you know the new sound and the because right you know, things and music and everything change and evolve, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly, you know, exactly. Is the, is yeah, the not... hard thumping, you know? Exactly, exactly. And and that's that's kind of what I'm getting at is, like me, myself, sometimes if I ask a question, it's usually because I'm, I'm trying to kind of pull that out, you know what I'm saying? How yeah, if you draw yeah, it yeah. out, you know? Um, definitely, so definitely. It's, it's good to kind of, for you to kind of talk about, you know, what you're doing is... Uh, it differentiates itself from, you know, what you what you're used to hearing. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, definitely yeah, a, yeah, a good yeah. marketing tool. You know, th th that is so true. So I mean, um, you talk about I mean, the, the, you went to the South Bronx and and you you, you want to do a performance and whatnot. So apart from the Bronx, have you been performing any other part of the United States or outside of the U.S.? No, um, I haven't performed out. Um, anywhere else because of the pandemic the place just start uh, open up back you know and mm -hmm. plus you know um it's like i'm starting from zero i'm brand new you understand mm -hmm. it's like i'm a new artist with a new name know? and everything so with a new name and with mm -hmm. just two songs mm -hmm. and since i i start this campaign mm -hmm. there a mega a mega hip-hop star reached out to me last week Ruko, i don't know if i tell you this before in the previous time we talked, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. I didn't tell nobody who this big hip hop hip hop star was, and I'm gonna re release this on your show. Well, I'll tell you this, man. Drop it. it. Definitely be eager to hear that, man. The great, <laughs> the great, legendary artist, Mr. Rhymes. Busta Rhymes DM me and me Yo. and King. See I do your music thing. Keep on work and go and grow your follower. You understand? Mm. And you know, him says some things behind it. You know, up, I got options. I got you know. Mm -hmm, let's mm -hmm. work. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice to see. It'd be nice to see a remix on this track. Oh yeah, I think Busta yeah. Rhymes would do a so good, really level, good remix on that track, man. Oh yeah. So. So, so the level of, of awareness and the campaign that I'm creating around right. my brand, mm -hmm. you know, it draw the attention of mm -hmm. that legendary rapper Buster Rhymes to, to you know, Recognize. say, all right, may I go bless up this little, may I bless up this little youth yeah, and tell him, say, yo, my go on good. Go on, do mm -hmm. your thing. We are going to link up soon. We are going to work. You understand? That make, that make me feel, yo, when I see the notification, I freeze. I actually I drive and freeze. So, so, so hold on, hold on, hold on. That, that so the main track, is a message. you got a legendary like the great Boston Ryan. Basically, take his time to actually give you a little heads up and say, "Yo, Sky Bar is a thing proper." It makes you feel you're doing something good. Yeah, it makes me feel like I'm wow. on the right track. Wow. And the, wow. and the, and the same man. performance I was telling you about. Right, the right. Views, it's it's two it's two hundred k and a and an Instagram post. The performance was so crazy and electrified, like a capital tan up on a stage or, or an elephant man. 
Right. That's the level of experience and that level of things we want to let out from all of these years. Y the years, you right. You understand? Right. Well, you know what they say in that life, bro. Right? Everything is just We just want to let it out one time. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's all about the timing, you know? Mm hmm. And like I say, what's, what's interesting, what's interesting about your brand um, of music that you're doing is that it's, it's really what's been missing uh, from dancehall from a long time. You know, it was a time, you know, where um, you would always have all these different dances and stuff, you know, where it was like, you know, you could listen to dancehall music with your children and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you had like the, yeah, the yeah. you had Scooby-Doo and you had, um, you know what? Uh, I think Sotex uh, did a track, the the Stop and Go track, and you know you had all these different things on the the Coca rhythm and stuff like that. Signal the yeah. signal the plane and all them song song there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, and and I mean you could you could listen to the oh, buddy, oh, buddy, yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah that's a big show, that's a big show man that's a big mix over your head over your head again. By Elephant. Yeah. Jiggy time again. Oh, man. Yeah. Nice yes. that, that stuff. You know? Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, for it, sure. It is so true. It is so true. Big up yourself, Ada, Charlotte, North Carolina. Big up yourself, Big up yourself yeah, man. right now. Yes, definitely, definitely. Big up big all of our listeners on big Facebook. Up. Yeah, man, definitely. Big up all of Facebook um, fans on Facebook who are listening right now as well, too. So, yeah, man. Um, so, how Sky Boss himself? Let's say... I mean, we all know the, the pandemic kind of screw a lot of things left, right, and center. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. What what has it taught you? You know what I'm saying? Within the pandemic, all right. But how Sky Boss really see himself? Let's say for the next five years or so, man. What's what is what is, what is, right. what is, what is some of the and some of the dreams? Yeah. All right. I think I'm. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna have some good records. I think I'm gonna release some good records because i'm a good writer i have another song called white tell, sand man. beach that is going to be released on the 26th of this month you know i already premiered the video on youtube i have um post a few clippings on my uh, on my instagram post though and i see where one of the posts have like forty-five thousand views on that video already on 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 and um and um instagram you know so mm. those are good signs yeah you know? that's great what what has what has it profession professionally and personally um what has the pandemic taught you mm -hmm. all right the pandemic taught me to yo the pandemic is, is so crazy it taught, Tell us about it, it man <laughs> <laughs> yo everything changed all right, the pandemic did. taught me to say, yo, yo, plan for something and it no work out. It teach me for just go with the flow. You understand? If you have something for the, some, sometimes you don't even um, make sense to put a time on it. Once you get right. the opportunity to, to do it, you just mm -hmm. do it and go with the flow. It's like the wind is blowing. Don't fight the wind. Flow with the wind or you button down. Yes. In, essence, in essence everything in life it's, it's all about the timing when the time not right it's not right timing. so tell us what was Skybar's plan before this pandemic what, what is it you, you had wanted to do I mean at the end of 2019 because we all know I mean COVID started F around and stuff like that to be honest with you somewhere in January of 2020 COVID started being, uh, affecting a lot of all of us around the world what is it you had in plan for the year 2020 all right, the year 2020, I wasn't, the 2019 and the 2020, I wasn't doing music. I oh, like, man. music was a part of mm -hmm. one side. Mm -hmm. So I was planning enough more creating a business, otherwise from music, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. Interesting. One yeah. of the time I was think, 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 thinking about starting up a construction company. Mm-hmm. Right, mm -hmm. because for, te for telling the truth, over the year doing music, I was like bitter against it. Mm. Interesting, man. Like most most people, like them close you out. 
close it out. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. I remember I used to work with this company before I migrated. They said, um, I migrated in 2016, so they said, all right, you know what? Mm-hmm. We love your brand, we love your music, we are going to we are going to give you the endorsement. We are going to give you the tool that you need. Right? Mm-hmm. And when the time comes, when, when the time comes, they change everything they said. It's like they pull ev- everything back and say some, something else. And I said, you know what? Mm-hmm. By, the day, by the end of the year, I'm going to migrate. Mm-hmm. You know? Mm-hmm. So That's I just right. migrated. You know, so everything was like a roller coaster ride. Right. Until 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 I found myself this year in the middle of the pandemic. So the pandemic let let me focus and think hard. You know? And, that, and that's important. What I really you know? want to do. Yeah. Right. Let me sit down, lay down, sleep, wake up, think. Right? Through mm. the dark times. It make me think. I make me find back myself. And mm. one of the person who give me that inspiration, you're gonna be shocked. You know, uh a DJ named Cargo. Yeah, man, Cargo. Yeah, Jifa, yeah. you know Cargo, mm-hmm. right? Yeah, you man. Remember what Cargo got to? Mm-hmm. Yeah, go on. Well, Cargo got to a lot and him cry out him hard on Facebook and social media. And one of the things where him say, him say, yo, artist, when you don't need, a, when you don't need to wait or sing for a producer. Forget on yourself out there. You can do it on yourself. Mm-hmm. You see a talented friend who want to have a musician who build a rhythm. You want to come together and you work as a team and produce on yourself. Mm-hmm. So I look into it and the level of experience that I have over the years. I said, you know what? I'm going to call up my friend them and buy some rhythm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then create my label, start my business and produce myself. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm a brilliant songwriter. I can see me that. I have experience man. in engineering. Mm-hmm. You understand? I may have experience in sales and promotion. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's, That's why right. I'm getting these feedback and these uh, feedback in the views. Mm-hmm. Buster Rhymes, dear me, and, and I bless and I bless me up, right? Mm-hmm. So you know? T- so technically, you're the one who promote your product. I'm the one who in control of everything that you see go going on. One person, and that's awesome, me, man. Sky Boss. Awesome, 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 awesome. Boy, I know we asked a lot of people. We just got a few minutes remaining because we have another interview and stuff coming up like that shortly. Um, collaboration, man, big thing. I know you said you you um you you actually doing a collab you actually did a collaboration. Did you send us the White Sand Beat song? Did you actually send us a song? I can't remember to be honest. Yeah, I think I sent you the video. I think I sent you the MP3 and the instrumental. Yeah, fine. Yeah. Look at the folder right now. I think see I see. White, white Sandy. I think they have an uh, uh, edited ver- version for our earplay. All right. G5 there's a raw look, version and there's an edited version. Look it up and see if you see in, in the folder there with Sky Boss. If you see any, any other thing. So, I can't remember. So, so this song now, um, I sit right in this car. The other... The other producer, engineer, musician named Danger from Grab Them Records. I call him up and I say, "Yo, I need I need some beats, you know. Send send me something on him. Send me two beats, I think, and I pick the one that I did White Sand Beach on, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, so I don't I don't see this you know, yet. Oh, you don't just see it give yet. Me a, it mm-hmm. give me a tropical vibe. The, the, the tropical vibe." So, Right, right. Yeah. Oh, so, you know. You know. Hold on. Oh, so you say you don't see G Fire? No, sir. Not, not, not as yet. Oh. oh did you oh. did you email it over or you you send it over? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe just a little, little clip. I think you sent me. But yeah, definitely, man. Definitely, really, really, really good stuff. You know what I mean? Listening to the music, listening to the flow on that beat. As I say, it's a really, really catchy kind of beat. And I mean, you listen to that song. Um, it got so much. It resembled the 1990s dancehall music so much, man. You know what I'm saying? And definitely, brother. Yeah. I mean, keep on pushing. But the question that we ask a, a, a lot, a lot of artists and stuff like that, man. 
Um, yeah, you actually said to me some time ago you was actually doing a collaboration with this. Uh, what, what is this girl in that came in the movie? Um, the Jamaican movie there. Jamaican mafia thing. Jamaican, yeah, Jamaican mafia. Ma yeah. So you actually doing a collaboration with Star that girl. Tina. Star Tina. Martina, that's Star Tina. Star Tina. Star uh, Tina. Yeah, the name of yeah, that's the name of the song. White Sand Beach featuring Star Tina. Yeah, no, the yeah. Cyber featuring Star Tina and White Sand Beach. The video right. is now up on YouTube, you know, and all you right. can also find it. You, you can also find it on my Instagram page, Skyboss Music, you know. Yeah, definitely. definitely. Excellent, definitely. excellent. Definitely. Yeah, Jifa, you have any and last words you want to close? I'm um, close up with Skyboss. Yeah, I uh, definitely just want to um, encourage you to keep doing what you're doing. You know, for anyone you know who who has experienced, you know just discouragement or you know animosity or hardship you know in becoming who they want to be as an artist you know what message do you have for them mm -hmm. whenever you hear some something that's so negative mm -hmm. you know like it's fighting against you take a deep look into it and try to assess it thoroughly mm -hmm. it might hurt your personal personally at first Mm -hmm. right but try to see if you can find positive out of it see if True. they are wrong True. and you right True. see if there is room where you can improve on what they're saying you understand mm -hmm. assess the situation mm -hmm. but always make your decision and go with your decision because at the end of the day when you make your decision are you going to get the result are you going to feel the result of everything you understand? So if you make a decision, so if you make somebody make a decision for you and it go wrong, you're gonna feel bitter. Mm. So at the end of the day, look into it and assess the situation and make your decision. Cause your decision I go it I got stick with you for the rest of your life. Real thing, real thing. Mm. Definitely. Definitely. And um, before we even go, I want to send a big shout out to Dwayne Minor, man. You know what I'm saying? Never you have the yeah, big legend, up, big uh, legendary up. record icon, Sugar, um, Sugar Minor. Sugar yeah, Minor. man. Even the one basically from the link, you know? So, for real, him for up, real. Man. big him up, big him up. So, if Dwayne someone. Minor, are, big up yourself, my G. Yeah, man. Brown Street, New York, you know? Real concrete jungle thing, man. man. All right. So, if someone listening to Skyboss right now would like to get in contact with Skyboss, maybe for promotion, um, dubs. Um, I mean, where they can find your music, etc. Now they can reach out to you. All right, they can find my music on all streaming platform. Sky Boss Dirt Dirt is available on all streaming platform. White Sand Beach will be available on all streaming platform the twenty sixth of this month. Mm -hmm. The White Sand Beach music video is already on YouTube. It's already on my Instagram. It's already on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Right, Skybox Dirt Dirt is out. The video is out. It's have over twenty nine thousand views on YouTube, right? Mm -hmm. And you can find me on Instagram at Skybox Music, and I'm a tough fan on all platform at Skybox Music. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Mm -hmm. S excellent, L -L excellent. O S S. One word. Stand? One word. No space. One word. Skybox Music on all on all platform. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. our so, social media platform on our social media platform that's what's up man that's what's up brother i mean it's been a pleasure to be honest with you as you know you had to be in the studio last week but as you already said a while in life everything is a timing you know what i mean so oh so, yeah for sure I mean, yeah. yeah man at the right time for you to be here tonight so we definitely want to bless you up man and keep on pressing you know what i'm saying keep on pushing um for wherever you want to go respect you know what i'm saying in life respect. so Really great vibes, really, really good stuff. Keep it up, man. G Fire, take it away, man. Yeah, man. Let's get into this track right here. We're going to do a little bit of mixing, take a quick break, and then get ready for our next artist who is coming up right here on Run Friday Night Vibes. Run this truck, man. Run this Run Yeah, man. Let's do this. Let's close it off with that. Big up, big up, big up, man, G. Thanks for having me. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Yeah, oh, yeah. Man. The general is there. Lesson, man. All right, the good general people. Good listen to the sky boss there. Jamaica, Trinidad, from America to England. Everybody, that's my place, man. It's Calvin. We tell her to be that. From 
Alright, so you know what, run the track G Fire. Pull it up! Party night vibes, you be see way to the sound of violence together. Come on, people, come on, come on, people, let's bounce right now, let's bounce right from America to England, anywhere that summer with this Spanish girl, them winter and Navidad. From a city girl, hey, hey, that's a no semi hey, hey, Couple girl, one sign. Hey, 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 Yeah. I tell you, at the Friday night fire, so we got a sky boss. Yeah, sky boss, so check the private chat. I send you the, I send you the link for the show. So you know what, you, 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 you can put it around across social media, yeah? Chickas and the slimmers, Jamaica, Trinidad, from America to England, anywhere that summer with the Spanish girl, them winter and Navidad, from a city girl, them a dancing, no semi-glad. Couple girl, one side, and a dirt, dirt. 